What's up, everybody? How's it going? It is Friday, September 9th. I'm in New York City, staying in this beautiful hotel with this incredible view. Check this out. Absolutely gorgeous. Really beautiful. And, uh, yeah, kind of here to update you guys on what I've been up to for the past week and all the craziness that I've been doing. So, let's begin. Um, last time we spoke, I think it was in rehearsals last Friday. Let me make sure this is filming first. Oh, there you guys are. Thank you. Somebody said I look sharp. I just did a photo shoot here in New York City for um, New York Times, so you can check that out soon. And um, been in rehearsals all week for um, for a, a a tour that obviously I'm going on now. We had the first show in Boston, and then had a show in Philadelphia. The Boston show was incredible. Like the fans were amazing, and to kick it off there was a dream come true to see your familiar, familiar faces and. To have you guys support me kind of going on this solo venture is a dream come true. And then Philadelphia was awesome. The crowd was insane. We were so packed in that room. It was so loud and exciting. I played that stage before with my brothers a long time ago. So to be back on that stage was was, was awesome. And now we are going, I'm going to Toronto, which is going to be fun. Oh, I guess I had the VMAs last weekend too. Or is that two weeks ago? I'm so always on the, just running around, so I don't really remember my schedule very well. But anyway, it's all good. I'm here to hang out with you guys anyway. And uh, we go to Toronto tonight, a 10-hour drive in the bus, which should be interesting. And then you have to do the border crossing, which is always kind of crazy. So it's a wake up in the middle of, of sleeping and then go do the border crossing. But I wanted to see if you guys have any questions and uh, see what you got. So here we go. Let's see what you got for me. I look happy. I am very happy today. Whoa, so your questions are interesting today. Let's see. Do you love Egypt? I, I've never been to Egypt. I would love to go, though. I'm sure I would love it. Are you coming to Europe? Yes, I'm coming to Europe. I'm going to be coming, um, I'm going to be coming, like, in a month, less than a month. I'm going to be going on tour with Britney Spears, for those of you who don't know. What socks are you wearing? I'm wearing black socks. Nothing too exciting. Let's see, what other questions? Ah. 20 new questions. You can write to my Twitter, by the way. What inspires you to stay strong? I'd say something that inspires me to stay strong is probably my family, my friends, you guys, the fans, uh, those of you who have stuck with me through this this uh, solo venture. Oh, by the way, I've got very exciting news. Um, the video premiere for Justin Love is like in a few days. I hope you guys watch. It's going to be a very exciting day for me, and I really I can't wait. So I want you to guys to to watch the new mu the music video. I know you guys watch the teasers. What do you think? What did I have for breakfast? I had an egg white omelet, some fruit. It was really good, delicious. These questions are funny. I do you like Italy? I love Italy. I'm Italian. What's your favorite song from Fast Life? My favorite song off Fast Life, I would say, um, I'm Sorry is one of my favorite songs. It was a tough song to write. It was a song about an end of a relationship and kind of going through those struggles and whatnot. So I wanted to kind of explain best my feelings and and how how difficult it can be to go go th through something like that when you hurt somebody what 
Would you rather have a cow or a parrot as a pet? That is an interesting question. Um, <laughs> cow might be hard to get around, but I, I would say... I would say... Uh, <laughs> I would say probably... A parrot. Because you can teach them to say things. It's always funny when a parrot says funny words or bad words. It's pretty hilarious. Would you like to come to Indonesia? I want to come to Indonesia really bad. I actually um, just recently tried to figure out how to make that happen. So I think if um, if the end of the year, um, if it works out, maybe I'll be making a trip to Indonesia. My question for you guys, are you coming on t to the tour at all? And have you already been to the shows and are, go to a, are going to another concert coming up? Because I'd love to see your familiar faces again. How long is your thumb? I'm sorry? It's not that long. It's a weird, really weird question. I'll see you in Denver. That's Becca Martinez, 15. I'll see you in Denver, Becca Martinez. Are you excited to party with Orlando because Orlando is excited to party with you? Yes, absolutely. I actually saw the physical copy of the album um, just a few days ago, and it was kind of freaking me out. <laughs> It was, just, it was a very exciting day for me. I just saw it because somebody was like, I'm excited to hold it. I went to your sax performance. Oh, yeah, yesterday I had something really cool that we did. Um, I performed at Saks Fifth Avenue here in New York City, and I performed a show for a good friend of mine, Simon Spur, who's a clothing designer, and we, we held this kind of launch for Fashion Night Out, and it was such an amazing experience amazing experience to be performing in a store was different but fun and the fans that came out we had a good time to play about three songs with me and Tony Royster who's my drummer and we just had it like a blast went to dinner with with Simon afterwards ate tons of food it's incredible is it true you're coming to Spain in November I don't know um, that that is news to me but I hopefully will be going to visit you guys I love your hair, but are you ever going to grow it out again? Um, maybe. I think it's, you know, hair. Luckily, I feel like I'm going to have my hair for quite a while, so I'll, I'll, I'll have plenty of time to grow it back out. But right now, it's nice to be able to have short hair. Easy to manage. Please say hi to Lauren. Hello, Lauren. Did you see both of your brothers yesterday? I saw Kevin. Kevin came to Regis and Kelly. We did that in the morning also, nice and early. It was so early yesterday when I did Regis and Kelly. I uh, woke up at like, uh, around close to 7-ish. Woke up, which is early for me. And I'm also in L.A. time, so it's very early. Did Regis and Kelly, performed I'm Sorry on Regis and Kelly for those of you who watched. Hopefully you guys enjoyed that. Then went to take a nap. And then Kevin actually came to Regis and Kelly, hung out. Kevin was all decked out in his suit. Pretty cool. Am I hungry? I am actually very hungry right now. Your dog says hi. Really? Your dog can talk? That's pretty incredible. He has a family dog. A family guy dog. Where's my dog? Um, I wish I could travel with my dog everywhere, but I can't. I've got to get him a dog passport, so that way I can travel with my pup everywhere, which would be fun. Why are you so beautiful? That's a weird question. Thank you, I guess, because my parents are good-looking people. Most played song on my iPod. I'll tell you right now, my most played song on my iPod right now. I'm looking at my, my iPhone to figure it out. I would say it's probably Coldplay, Every Teardrop is a Waterfall. That song is addictive. 
very good music. Alright, I'll take a few more questions. Where is Jason? Wow, they want Jason. I don't know where he is. Doing something. Ustream doesn't work on my Blackberry. Oof. Can you get me an iPhone for Christmas? Maybe. Billy was awesome. Well, thank you very much. I appreciate that. Does Winston enjoy watching SpongeBob? <laughs> I actually do leave the TV on for Winston when, when I when I leave for the day, and he does watch TV. I, I've caught him watching television quite a few times. No joke. Well, guys, listen. Love you all very much, and this was fun chatting with you guys. I love doing these Fast Fridays. It's nice to check in every Friday and catch up and kind of see what you guys are up to. Um, I have to go run because I'm about to do this AOL kind of acoustic session. Um, it's going to be a lot of fun. Do play about five songs, so you can check that out later this week. Thank you so much for tuning in, and I will see you next Friday. And I'll, Or if you're coming to the concert this week, I'll see you then. All right, I love you guys so much. And uh, make sure you remember Justin Love. It's going to be airing on Ryan Seacrest, and the video is going to premiere on E. So check it out. All right, guys. Have a good one. Bye.